the Alliance Française is a non-profit organization. Our aim is to promote the French language and the French culture and to organize events and uh, to promote uh, the diversity of the cultures towards the islands and also to organize some inter-exchange inter program between St. Kitts and Nevis, Guadeloupe, Martinique, St. Martin, all our French neighboring islands. So this program has been something we had in mind for a long time. We see a lot of tourists coming on the island, this is a major industry. We have a lot of students learning French as well and usually most of the time we are telling them that you know, you have to think about how the French language can help you in the future. You know, you never know, you can be not only a teacher, you can be working in tourism industry. There's a lot of job here around that. So you can use that language to, you know, to get this as an asset for your career. The program starts on the 4th of July until the 28th of August. The, the Ministry of Tourism have made a, a collaboration with the Ministry of Education to uh, request to target uh, one or two students from each school who were very keen in the language and this is how they got selected. The enrollment per student is 720 EC dollars and this is uh, completely funded by the Ministry of Tourism and the Sankey's Tourism Authority. Most of our classes are related to tourism industry, hospitality, so that will be about interacting with the tourists but also being able to explain what is that monument. Uh, I spoke with the parents specifically and to me the parents are even more excited than the children. Um, I think that this sums it up. One parent said to me that her daughter normally travels during the summer vacation, but she's foregoing her vacation this summer to make sure that she is on island to attend these courses. So I think that that speaks volumes about the excitement, the interest, the passion that these students have. I must say that this is a really exciting opportunity, fabulous opportunity for us at the Ministry of Tourism to engage our future workforce. Yes, they are in school now, but at some point, these are the, the persons who are going to enter the workforce. But for the immediate future, more like the resumption of the tourism, um, the, the, the tourism season around September, October, November. We are thinking that when they, especially when the, the cruise ship that brings in the, our French visitors, when they come in, we are going to use some of these same students, hopefully on the weekends, to um, work with the taxi operators, the tour guides, perhaps in one or two of our restaurants, so that when the um, visitors go to these establishments when they um, um, take these tours that these are some of the young people with whom they would be interacting and, and as Marin said they would be equipped with the vocabulary to be able to point out our monuments, talk about our cuisine, talk about our hotels and restaurants and be good ambassadors and invite those persons to come back on island and bring other friends and family with them. 